It's my fellow Geminis. What is going on with you for the week? We have on Monday the 18th, which is today, talk from your grandmothers, your maternal ancestors, aunties, feminine energy, living and deceased, watching over you, helping you to do a little bit of self-development, cleansing, and clearing out of things that no longer serve you. A lot of this felt to me like self-images, you know? Are you are you nervous? Are you always pushing yourself harder than what you should? You know, are you trying to live up to someone else's standards? Can you just be more at peace with yourself? I feel like, you know, a lot of you have done the hard work and you're not really reaping the rewards and benefits because you haven't learned to relax and incorporate it all. So those ladies are trying to help you with all of that. On Wednesday, the 20th, I have an increase in love. Now, love meaning romance, but this can also be for some of you, just anyone who is in your heart or is really important to you. I do feel um, that there is also talk of, you know, a potential engagement, um, marriage proposals. Uh, there's additions to the family with that. We could see an old lover returning from the past. We could see a relationship that was about to dissolve itself. It just become almost like resolved. And, you know, we've decided we're going to work on it. So you might be getting some kind of an agreement out of a love partner that you weren't able to get in the past or they're actually doing the work. So. Just be mindful that it is there as a potential. Um, we have an increase here with your money and potential investment outlets, but I did hear you're going to have to spend it to make it. And this ran all the way from Wednesday the 20th all the way to Monday the 25th. Um, and probably beyond that, I ran out of paper because I'm only doing these for one week. So it looked like it continued through there for a while. So a theme for you, my fellow Geminis, is going to be investment. What are you doing with your time, with your wisdom, with your money? Um, where you put it is really going to prosper for you, but this is no time to hold back and hoard what you have to give. So the opportunities are going to be there. It's going to be blatantly obvious. On Friday the 22nd, I heard, pst, pst, I heard people trying to get your attention, and they look small. And that can mean that they're small people <laughs> in the literal sense. That could also mean that they're immature, that they're childish or childlike. I heard pss, pss, these people trying to get you to turn around. Now, what's interesting about that is that anytime there's something behind you, I'm instantly on guard for that. You should always be looking dead ahead. Sodom and Gomorrah, you never look behind you, right? And everything of prosperity goes to the right side of your body or you know just if, if we were doing linear reading that's how the energy should flow or right in front of you and this was behind okay so that is unfinished business that is skeletons in the closet that's problematic energy but here's the thing it's not yours it's theirs okay so if there are people trying to get your attention or a situation trying to suck you back in even if it comes through as an opportunity or something light or playful or something that's masked as having change i think you're going to really want to be on guard for that uh what your ancestors wrote here was it's from the past but they're not ready or it's not real or it hasn't improved. Sunday the 24th, I saw you as a train. Whenever I see you as a train, that's going to mean that you are boundary setting and you're moving full steam ahead. And this had to do with other people. I heard stop waiting on them and no more tears. So your ancestors and your guides don't wanna see you waste any more time or energy on people or situations that just are not going to come around in the way that you had hoped. On Monday the 25th, I saw you as a train again, but in a very different way. There was talk of movement forward with your residency, with investments, with your job, sort of like as a promotion or a leveling up with your career. There's a general sense of you leaving where you were and going forward. And it wasn't just figurative. It was a quite literal as in location. There was also talk of all eyes are going to be on you and you're going to be seen on Monday the 25th. Geminis, have a great week.